The USS Zumwalt DDG-1000 is one of the most advanced and distinctive warships ever constructed for the United States Navy, representing a radical shift in naval design and technology. Unlike the traditional silhouettes of destroyers, the Zumwalt's appearance is strikingly futuristic, with a unique tumble-home hull that slopes inward above the waterline, designed not only to reduce its radar signature, but also to give it the stealth profile of a much smaller vessel. This massive ship, stretching over 600 feet in length and displacing more than 15,000 tons, often appears on radar as something closer to a fishing boat or a small craft, which makes it an enigma at sea. Its angular design, wave-piercing bow, and minimized superstructure make it an icon of 21st century naval engineering, a ship built for both intimidation and invisibility. Inside the Zumwalt lies an array of state-of-the-art systems that separate it from conventional destroyers. It operates with an integrated power system, an all-electric propulsion technology, capable of producing nearly 80 megawatts of power, enough to supply the energy needs of a small city. This immense energy output not only drives the ship but also provides room for future weapons, such as directed energy lasers and advanced railguns, technologies the Navy envisions deploying in years to come. With such a system, the Zumwalt is far more adaptable than traditional warships, capable of being upgraded continuously as new technologies become viable. This forward-looking approach is a hallmark of the Zumwalt class, as the Navy intended these destroyers to be experimental platforms that push the boundaries of maritime warfare. The primary armament of the Zumwalt, originally centered on its two advanced gun systems, massive 155 mm guns designed to launch precision projectiles at long ranges. However, the cost of the specialized ammunition became so prohibitive that the weapons have remained largely unused. This led to a shift in the ship's mission profile. With the Zumwalt now being prepared for roles in surface warfare, anti-air operations, and land attack missions using a combination of advanced missiles, vertical launch system cells embedded across the ship's hull can carry a diverse set of weapons, including Tomahawk cruise missiles, anti-ship missiles, and anti-air interceptors, making it flexible for multiple combat scenarios. The ship's electronic warfare systems further enhance its ability to operate in complex environments, allowing it to disrupt enemy targeting and defend itself from incoming threats without even firing a missile. The Zumwalt is not only a war machine, but also a marvel of crew efficiency and automation. Where older destroyers might carry well over 300 sailors, the Zumwalt operates effectively with fewer than 150, thanks to advanced computer systems, automation, and streamlined operations. This reduction in crew size not only lowers operating costs, but also reflects a philosophy of minimizing human exposure to danger while maximizing technological support. Sailors on board the Zumwalt work in high-tech control centers, resembling the interiors of spacecraft, with digital touchscreens, integrated data systems, and advanced command interfaces. Instead of relying on mechanical switches and traditional layouts, the ship is managed through a centralized digital nervous system that allows commanders to monitor every aspect of the vessel's performance with precision. Living conditions on board reflect the Navy's recognition of crew, welfare and extended deployments. Modernized berthing areas, better climate control, and recreational facilities offer a quality of life superior to earlier warships. Every element of the Zumwalt, from its weapon systems to its living quarters, represents an evolution in naval philosophy, where technology enhances not just combat effectiveness, but also the endurance and resilience of those who serve aboard. The ship's namesake honors Admiral Elmo Zumwalt Jr., a former chief of naval operations known for his forward-thinking reforms and modernization of the Navy during the Cold War. Just as Admiral Zumwalt pushed the Navy toward innovation in his era, the ship that bears his name embodies the spirit of transformation, breaking away from traditional design principles to pave the way for the future fleet. With its advanced stealth capabilities, electric power system, and digital architecture, the Zumwalt is not merely a destroyer, but a prototype of what future naval warfare could become. Despite its impressive design and technological promise, the Zumwalt program has been a subject of debate. Originally, the Navy planned to build more than 30 of these futuristic ships. But rising costs and shifting strategic needs reduced the number to just three vessels. Each Zumwalt-class destroyer represents an investment of billions of dollars, raising questions about affordability versus innovation. However, even with such limited numbers, 
The ships serve as test beds for revolutionary concepts that may influence the entire naval fleet in the decades ahead. The challenges of cost and practicality do not diminish the technological achievements embodied in the Zumwalt, but rather highlight the risks inherent in pushing the envelope of military design.